For these students at Chicago High School for Agricultural Sciences, their classroom is the kitchen. Since Monday, they've been preparing early Thanksgiving dinners for about 350 senior citizens who otherwise would not get a home-cooked holiday meal. Welcome, sir. It's an event in its 10th year, back in person for the first time since the pandemic. During this season of giving thanks, you know, we want to bring people together, and so we're so excited to be able to be back in the gym this year. These students, mostly juniors and seniors, have been hard at work prepping the meals, getting tips from a professional, Chef Diego Burgos. They're doing a great job. Uh, you can tell they really have a passion for it. Student Ayana Mackey says it's hard work, but she enjoys it. We had to saute the vegetables and steam them, brine the turkeys, butter the turkeys, season the turkeys, you know, sweet potatoes, cranberry sauce. A meal that is a farm to table experience. The school has the only working farm in the city of Chicago with students growing all of the ingredients from corn to pumpkins. They even raise the turkeys. You get to see them alive and walking around and then now we're cooking them. <laughs> it was kind of weird doing that, but like it's kind of like the circle of life happens all the time. The students say the big payoff is watching their guests enjoy what they've cooked. I can't tell you how many times I hear, you know, uh, I'll hear a senior say, oh, when I was in high school, and, and then or ask them questions and, and vice versa. It's just the interaction between the seniors and our students is, is, is what I think it's all about. Students also set the tables in the gym, decorating them with these centerpieces made by horticulture students that the senior citizens will get to take home. But there's a bigger takeaway for everyone, giving thanks for the chance to get to know someone new. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.